Come on, pup. Good boy. Hey honey, what was Psalm um, 34 verse 3 that we did the other day, but it didn't record right? Oh, magnify the Lord with me, and let us exalt his name together. Okay, okay, yeah, so it was, come let us tell of the Lord's greatness. What do you like, NLT? Yeah. All right, so yeah, I did, you know, we talked about Psalm 34 and 2 a couple weeks back. But now, reflecting on Psalm 34 verse 3. Which is a yeah. good one. Come, let us tell of the Lord's greatness. Let us exalt his name together. Come tell of the Lord's greatness. Let There's 22 verses. Probably can learn those things. That's what I'm trying to do. In Spanish, it's Vengan, hablemos de las grandezas del Señor. Exaltemos juntos su nombre. Mm -hmm. See, that's what happens when you know what you're talking about. And so, honey, so what he's trying to say is, and I think we talked about this before, but it's just such a... Um, a a really a powerful concept for believers that you know to testify to each other, especially and to the lost of the greatness of God, the goodness of the Lord. That God is great; He's worthy of our praise. He's good, and His mercy endures. He's patient. He's kind. And so, you know, I, I think about David in the Psalm, kind of encouraging himself. You know, um in an excitement to tell of the great things that the Lord has done mm -hmm. towards other people, you know, to encourage other people to encourage himself as well. Mm -hmm. And so, you know, um, and then he says, you know, let us exalt his name together. So come, let us tell of the Lord's greatness. Let's speak of the good things he's done. Let's remember those things. And then let's praise and exalt his name together. Once again, I think, I believe, really showing us the importance of fellowship, <clears throat> you know, um, as, a, as, a, as a collective. When people get together and and praise the Lord, it's more than just uh, you know two or three songs before the preaching on a Sunday. It's really a, a, a community of believers that get together and and exalt the name of God. You know, lift Him up above their problems, above their issues. You know, just remembering that God is good. Mm -hmm. And so, what, what's your take on that verse? Um, the NLT is it all? Come, um, let's tell up the. The Lord's greatness. Right. It's Let us all sing together. Mm -hmm. Well, definitely. Or come. Because I'm saying, I'm telling more than one person to come. Let us tell. It can be evangelism too. Let us tell. Right. That's good. So, I mean, yeah. let us tell. Meaning, people, um, we need to be vocal about it. Not mm -hmm. silent. We're witnessing, we're evangelizing, we're telling. And let us exalt, meaning lift his name up, not ourselves. Mm -hmm. Let us exalt his name together. Together, meaning one mind, one body, in unity, not in strife, not in conflict or in bitterness, but in agreement. Because I think. What I see here, because I know you tell your version, I want to take a different take on it. Um, sometimes believers come together and 
you know. Um, we're not in that same one mind, <laughs> mm -hmm. you know, in regards to, you know, sometimes it could be just disagreement in how the order for service is going, or who is greeting, or the worship team, the biggest hit of all, who is singing, what song they're singing, you know, but I think that when we come together and we ex exalt and we tell of its greatness, Man, we're glorifying God. We're putting aside these things, indifferences, and where there is unity, the Lord commands a blessing. So, Amen. Amen. Um, yeah. Yeah. We don't see the. We don't see the fullness of the Lord if we haven't allowed Him to fully, you know, dwell in our minds and in our hearts, and. We all give him the full attention, mm -hmm. give him our full surrender, give him our full. Yeah, and I, and, I, and I think that's what a lot of David's Psalms come back to is a constant, um, a constant reminding himself of really just fully being surrendered to the Lord at, at all times, you know. And so I think even in this one, he's like, let's tell the Lord's greatness, let's exalt his name together. Just it's, it's more confirmation and affirmation towards just yeah. meditating upon who God is all the time you know he hides his word in his heart he seeks him constantly you know and so to me I, I mean the more that I really get into the Psalms the studies that we've been doing through Psalm 119 as well the more I think you see that that even though David had some issues and some downfalls in his life I, I believe he was a very disciplined and regimented man when it came to the things of the Lord you know for, for the most part for sure you know like mm -hmm. he was it, it was a serious thing for him he didn't just he wasn't just a casual believer you know, and so it's really a challenge for us to really kind of walk in those same shoes. But um, even as we're looking at David, you know, I mean, this Psalms 34, like, what Let's is he, that one. what is he doing? Is he fighting a battle? Is he has he been with Saul? Has those um, you know attacks, you know, happen where he's escaping prison? Like, what state? So it, it'll be nice to know. You know, I know we're talking about it. But it would really like it would really be nice to know in Psalm 34, what is um, well, what was happening? Being... What is um, um what is David's position at this time? <laughs> <laughs> there he is. Hi. He's got a friend. <laughs> Bucky, come on. Come on. You're good. You're good. <laughs> come on, Bucky. Come on. It would oh. be it would be nice to know what what's what where 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 is David at the moment of saying this because. Mm -hmm. Then it would, then it would be very. Um, you need to me. Come on. Then it would be Come something on. to see that, man. David is encouraging people and saying this even in the midst of fleeing for his life. Right. He's encouraging people to. So, very well. How are you, sir? Good. 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 Yeah. To finish my point, it would be like, wow, look, look at us, because. If he is in the mix, mix, if he if he is in the midst or at the moment of conflict, then man, and he's seeing this like much more encouraging it is for you and I, like in the midst of what is happening right. to glorify the Lord. And you know, I want to believe that David was never in a moment where he he wasn't being attacked. There was never a moment in his life where he's not being persecuted. Or he has he has to look over his back. I think every moment he's he is fighting for his life. No, he fighting to stay alive. He definitely had a full plate, that's for sure. Come on, honey. Except for the, there's a wasp running and flying around. Pretty nice though. Yeah. What if God knows? <laughs> to think that we've been living right down the street and I didn't even know this place was here. I think it happened since last year because I think McCormick came and planted a tree too. Everybody had to donate a tree so they came up here and they planted a tree. So that's how these trees are being sponsored. 
bike ride. Pretty nice. That's I mean, nice. it's very nice and relaxing. It is. Now let's keep a move on. The sun's gonna be going down here pretty soon, and I know the puppy I needs. I don't know why people litter though. That's crazy. Needs. Why does people litter? Because these are the stuff that get the the drains clogged up. I roll. So this is our first walk through Gretna City Park right here off of Gretna Boulevard in Gretna. So this is me, him, and the pup. And so yeah, just reminding ourselves and all those out there to continue to tell of the Lord's greatness, declare it to those who are without hope, especially those who are needing an encouragement. Remember the Lord's greatness and worship and praise and exalt his name together. Amen. We praise the Lord. Thank him for his goodness in our lives always. So on, until next time, remember, come on, pup. Till next time, always remember to keep your eyes on the prize. And what, honey? And your knees on the ground. And your knees on the ground. <laughs> God bless. Come on, Pop. Come on. Good boy. Good boy. We love you, Pop. Do you have a good time? All right, sit. Nice little sit. Sit. All right, good boy. Here we go.